Hey, it's Rob Jordan, and we're here today at the College Prep Invitational in Wellington, Florida for 2013. And I'm here today with the University of Florida equestrian team. Hey guys, how are you? Good. How are Good. You? Could you introduce yourselves and what you do? I'm Karen Kenny, as coach for the UF team. I'm Carrie Allen, a senior on the team, and I was captain of the Huntsy team last year. I'm Lindsay Powers, I'm a senior on the team, I'm the captain this year. I'm Samantha Bohm, I'm a sophomore on the team and co-captain. Great. So, um, let me just ask you a real quick question. What took you from high school, which is what most of the kids here are doing, to wind up where you are now? You want to go first? Yeah, I'll go first. Um, in high school, I showed at WEF a lot of weekends, but um, WEF can get really expensive. So I was looking for something that I could do uh, more consistently. And unfortunately, when I was in high school, they didn't really have IEA as prominent as it is today. Um, so I knew going into college that I wanted to ride, but I knew that I wasn't going to be horse showing at double-A shows, I knew I wanted to ride for a college team, so um, I think IHSA was perfect for me in that aspect. That's great. And you? Um, I showed my horse when I was in high school, and UF is always my first choice of college, so when I came here I found out the equestrian team and I've been on it ever since my freshman year. That's great. I did some uh, local shows as well as A shows. I also was on IEA team in high school for sophomore and, or sorry, junior and senior year. So when I came into college, I already knew the format of it and I know I wanted to be on the team and UF is just a great school, so. Great, and as a coach, do you have anything in particular that you look for in riders? Um, basically what we look for in riders is uh, the love of the sport, the love of the horses, um, their, their interests. Basically, um, their um, their interest in the sport, dedication, dedication. And do you have any dedication. pointers for kids that are coming and perhaps would like to go to the school? Anything that they should be working on at home that can really prepare them for this level of riding? I think the IEA teams are a good start, um, good introduction for this. It gives them an opportunity to sit on different horses at the horse shows. I think it's it's done really well for for all of you girls. That's great, and how would you summarize the show for all of you guys this weekend so far? Oh, I think it's great. I think this is just amazing to me. I, I, this is the first time I've experienced this, and, uh, and as far as the IHSA, uh, Kim and I just love it. Love the girls. They're, we have a great group of girls. That's great. Yeah, I actually did this show uh, two years ago, I think, um, in Gainesville, and it was a good opportunity for me when I was looking for schools, so I ha I was on the other side of this, where I was, you know, a senior in high school looking for somewhere to ride and go to school, so I, like, for me it was helpful, so that's why I wanted to go and represent UF and show the riders here that we have a team and want to. That's great. Did you have a similar experience? Um, I did not do IEA, um, but being a senior on this team, we really wanted to get here and show the incoming freshmen that we have a team that isn't a varsity team. They can go to a great school and then be a part of a team just for a rec sport. I also think it's kind of encouraging because there's a lot of people out there that don't have any opportunity to, to have an IEA team at mm -hmm. all. So it's kind of nice that you can get as high level as you right. are without that. Good. Well, guys, thanks so much for taking the time. Thank you. And this is Rob Jordan for Sidelines TV.